Hey guys, what's up? It's Looney TNT. So today we're going to go over the best DPS classes and specs in Old War currently for Wrath of the Lich King Classic. Now, we have, we're going to look at two graphs today. Uh, Wowhead actually had four, but we're going to focus on the two. The, uh, the other two that they had were the 95 uh, percentile, which... You know what? I, I want to look at a uh, just an overall statistically wise what's going on. Um, if you're like top in the world, cool. But we're gonna focus on everybody here today. So the first graph that we're looking at is we're looking at overall damage, right? Um, this is uh, this is pretty interesting for overall damage, as you guys can see. I, I don't think we were uh, very surprised, right? Um, Unholy Death Knight is doing really well. Um, I was actually, I switched my DK to, to Frost, and I'm actually enjoying Frost a little bit more than uh, Unholy. I think Unholy is just so, um, they're so, like, gear dependent that I just wanted to kind of uh, play with some Frost a little bit, and I, I've, I've been enjoying it. Um, Affliction Warlocks, you know, let's look at, like, um, like demo and destruction right now. I feel like every warlock that I've grouped with Overall is doing pretty well. So like you your class might not be the top here But that doesn't mean that uh, you know, it's necessarily in a uh, a Horrible spot. You know what I mean? I I, I still think you're doing uh, there's classes out there that can do a uh, uh, big damage regardless on your spec like if you look at red paladin Rep Paladin is uh, below half, right? But if you've grouped with a decent Rep Paladin, they're they're throwing out some damage right now. So it's uh it's pretty interesting, right? But this is overall. Let's look at boss fights. So overall, for just like, let's look at bosses, right? Um, Rogue is on top. If you've <laughs> if you have a Rogue in your group that's doing single target damage. They are monsters right now. They are they are doing so much damage, which is awesome. I, I love to see it, right? Um, when you look at a uh, Unholy DK, they are definitely up there. Affliction Warlock still up there. Combat Rogue, you know, so we have the double Rogue spec. Um, sub is all the way down there, but you know what? That's okay. Um, if you look at the top three, uh, top three classes in my opinion, Rogue, Warlock, DK. You know, those are one, two, three. But when you look at all, all their other specs, they're they're up there too. So, I don't know. I, I think they're in a good spot. Enhancement Shamans, um, they're doing pretty well right now too. I've I've grouped with more Elemental Shamans than I have Enhancement lately. Um, I'm just, I'm not sure if people are looking for a lot of range, as people are getting ready for Elemental for uh, for TOC. I'm not sure, but um, but I have been seeing a lot of Elemental Shamans in it. Uh, survival hunter a little bit low, but that said, I've seen some hunters blast this expansion. So I don't know. It's it's kind of uh, it's kind of up to you, right? And we have uh, balance and feral a little bit lower, and then look, we have red all the way at the bottom. But you red paladins, just wait. You ferals or fury warriors, just wait. You guys are gonna be up there pretty soon when uh. When you guys can start stacking, uh, like for for Fury, when you start stacking that armor penetration, you can get a get pretty high. It's gonna be pretty amazing. So, I think overall, I think the classes are in a good spot. I, I don't. I've played with a lot of different classes, whether it would be raids or um, uh, dungeons and things like that, and I can I can honestly say. If it was a good player, I wouldn't mind taking any of these classes, and you can kill any of the content in the game right now. Like, don't be fooled and think you can't kill uh, Yogg without a with a uh, Rep Paladin because it can be done, right? So when you look at these graphs, don't be like, "Well, I'm not the meta class, so I'm not going to take these other meta classes." I really enjoy raiding with Boomkin, and Boomkin is, uh, you know, quite a bit lower also there too. And if you guys want to follow me on TikTok, I got TikTok notifications, Looney TNT on TikTok. Go check it out. But that said, there are some of the uh, the top damage classes in the game. Uh, currently as we sit in going into week nine so this is actually week nine of uh, of resets 
And, uh, you know, hey, TLC, we're, we're going to be creeping with TLC pretty soon. I, I could feel it. It's coming. So like, favorite, share, subscribe. What class are you playing? And what class would you like to, uh, if you could pick one class that could get a little bit of a buff, what would it be? All right, guys. Talk with you guys again soon.